Welcome in this short video on speech organs. In this video, we are going to talk about vocal cords, palate, teeth, tongue, and lips, which are the main speech organs in the production of human speech sounds. The vocal cords are two flap strips of rubber lying opposite to each other. Um, they are situated at the top of the air passage. And you can see here the uh, yellow catches, which includes the um, the strips of the vocal cords and uh, you know the, the vocal cords alone are not enough for the production of speech sounds we need other organs for the production of speech sounds including the mouth, uh, the nasal cavity, the teeth, lips, so on and so forth the palate the second speech organs is simply the roof of the, of the mouth and you can see this here uh, uh, has uh, this roof of the mouth has uh, four parts it has the alveolar ridge it has the hard palate soft palate and the uvula and each part of the roof of the mouth is responsible for the protection of specific speech sounds and this of course determined by the flexibility of the tongue so if we for example move the the tip of the tongue again as the alveolar edge, which is the uh, place just behind the upper teeth, we can produce the sound T. If we move the front of the tongue, again as the hard palate, we can produce the sound SH. If we move the back of the tongue, again as the soft palate, we can produce the sound K. And if we move the root of the tongue, again as the uvula, we can produce sounds like, for example, the African G or the Arabic G and so on and so forth. So, uh, the roof of the mouth is called the palate and has four main parts, the alveolar ridge, the hard palate, the soft palate, and the uvula. The third organ is uh, uh, the teeth. And the, we, ha you know, we have the upper set of teeth and the lower set of teeth and uh, uh, you know the teeth um, uh, alone we cannot uh, produce sound using all the teeth we need uh, the tongue the flexibility of the tongue to produce sounds so if we move the tip of the tongue again as the upper set of teeth we can produce sound like for example that um, we can uh, put the tip of the tongue between the upper teeth and lower teeth and you can produce sound like for example uh, that and then we have the tongue. The tongue is the most important organ of speech. And this is because of the flexibility it has and because of the movement it has uh, within the, the, the mouth cavity. Um, uh, uh, so we can, for example, move the tip of the tongue, again as the alveolar edge, and we can produce the sound uh, te and te. Uh, we can move the back of the tongue, again as the soft palate, and we can produce uh, sounds like ge and ke and uh, you know uh, the movement of each part of the tongue again as the the palate we can produce different sounds and the tongue has mainly five parts it has the tip the plate the front back and the root and moving the tip of the tongue again as the alveolar ridge we can produce sounds like te, te for example uh, moving the the blade of the tongue again as the uh, the hard palate we can produce sound like de. Moving the front of the tongue again as the hard palate too, we can produce sounds like sh. Moving the back of the tongue again as the soft palate we can produce sound like uh, ge. And moving the back of the tongue again as the the very back of the uh, of the of the uh, roof of the of the mouth we can produce sound like for example and uh, they sounds. So, uh, because of the flexibility of the tongue and the different positions that it has, again, as the, uh, the, uh, the palate, uh, it's the most important uh, organ of speech. And finally, we have the lips. Uh, the shape of the lips uh, determines uh, the, uh, the sound. Uh, so, for example, uh, using flat lips, we can produce sounds like E. Uh, using round lips, we can produce sound like O. Uh, using open lips, we can produce sound like A. So uh, the lips uh, are also an organ of speech, 
and the different shapes of the lips uh, determine different English sounds. Uh, that's for the August of speech and please subscribe for future videos. Thank you very much.